Welcome to another edition of Take 5, and a lot of these have been Take 3s, uh, because I'm not going to read uh, long passages uh, when we're dealing with all this worship in the tabernacle stuff, and, and we're still in that, even though we've changed to another book, where uh, you'll see that right now, verse 1, Leviticus 1, the Lord called to Moses and spoke to him from the tent of meeting. All right, so he's not up on the mountain anymore. Now God's down actually in in the tent. You know, they built all this for him. And uh, so God's there. It's his house now. And uh, so Moses doesn't have to go too far. So that's a good thing. And he said, speak to the Israelites and say to them, when anyone among you brings an offering to the Lord, bring as your offering an animal from either the herd or the flock. If the offering is a burnt offering from the herd, you are to offer a male without defect. You must present it at the entrance to the tent of meeting so that it will be acceptable to the Lord. You are to lay your hand on the head of the burnt offering and it will be accepted on your behalf to make atonement for you. Uh, you're not going to like what I'm about to read, I'll be honest. But here we go. Verse 5. You are to slaughter the young bull before the Lord and then Aaron's sons. The priest shall bring the blood and splash it against the sides of the altar at the entrance to the tent of meeting. And, and I'm going to let you read the rest of the chapter yourself. But the, the main point there is that everything, uh, there was always blood. There had to be blood uh, to make atonement for people. And it only made atonement. Uh, and atonement means that, um, atonement means it means it makes people right with God. It gets rid of their sins. All right. That's what that word means. And, and they, and they used the blood of animals to do that, but it was ceremonial. It wasn't permanent. It didn't really take away sin. Only the blood of Christ takes away sin. But you see, over and over and over again, they were reminded of their sin. Because every time they offered one of these animals, they had to kill the animal and offer its blood. It was reminded that they were sinners. Aren't you glad that our Lord died one time and offered his blood and we don't have to do it over and over and over again all right hey you could i'm sorry about that that's the way they did it though i mean i, I know you love animals and but uh that's what they had to do so anyway we'll be in chapter two next time all right and we'll be covering more stuff like that on the next edition of take five